Okay, so what are you showing us today, Matthew? I'm going to show you how to uh, keep your clevises and Lee style uh, control horn from buckling and snapping like that and losing them up in the air. Pulling them apart. Okay. All you're going to need is, uh, for something like this, about uh, an inch of fuel tubing and cut it about three eighths inches long. And this is, I think, 332nd ID. Okay. And 316th OD. What you'll want to do is stick that on the edge of your needle nose pliers. So it's flush at the top. Pull them out as far as you can. Stick them inside like that. And they'll pinch pretty tight right there. You'll also need a flat blade screwdriver. Dig them apart like that. And be able to get your other piece there. Slide it in. Push that up to your knuckle there. Now it ain't going to come apart. Nice. And that usually with our scratch build, even the electrics, yeah, even you can with, use that for uh, just about everything. Even uh, control horns. Next step with this one here, you can see I have the fuel tubing on all three of those. But I have to put fuel tubing on this yet, and it's the same thing only with the control the clevises. I would only use about a quarter inch or so fuel tubing. Same diameter and everything, just same everything, just cut about a quarter inch. You just wanted to cover up that little pin there. Okay, very nice. And then that way it keeps it from coming apart in the air or anywhere, really. Yeah, and, and the other thing with uh, these style uh, clevises that thread on, they have the nut there. If you don't have thread locker, CA and uh, some uh, kicker on that nut there so they don't back loose and unthread.